This is Around the Horn for FantasyAlarm.com. I'm your host, Ray Flowers. Jimmy Rollins is in the news. The Phillies want to move on from him. The Phillies want to move on from a lot of their veterans looking to cut payroll and start the youth movement that they desperately need. So the 36-year-old Rollins could be on his way out. He's due $11 million in 2015. That's a lot of money for a 36-year-old who, you know, really isn't the player he once was. 319 on base percentage the last three years. Not great. 250 batting average the last three years. But he has averaged 15 home runs, 27 steals, 50-plus RBIs, and about 75-80 runs over the last three years. Those are still good numbers. They're not great, but good numbers. And especially in a fantasy game, they're good numbers. In fact, last season, 17 home runs, 28 steals. How many players in baseball match those two numbers of Jimmy Rollins? Two. Charlie Blackman, Carlos Gomez. Pretty good. Yeah, and he's a shortstop. Jimmy Rollins is a flawed ball, ball player. He's always been more productive than he should be because he never gets hurt and because he hits at the top of the order. Doesn't get on base very well. Doesn't have the big-time power or the big-time speed. But as I noted, a player who for the last three years is averaging 15 home runs and 27 steals, who went 17-28 last year, he is still a viable option in the fantasy game. As long as you can work around that 250 batting average, that's not going to improve. It's probably going to maybe even dip a little bit lower as we move forward. But Jimmy Rollins still productive in the fantasy game, even if he's not worth it in the real world of baseball.